What is up everyone and welcome back to Boo Bros. Today we have a completely different video than normal. We're going to be doing an HHN Mystery Box unboxing. And guess what? We're on the box. Roll the intro. Now, if you guys are new here to Boo Bros, do me a favor and smash that like button and also subscribe to let us grow here together. Today's video will be focusing on the box that was released by HHN Orlando Fan underscore page. I'll put that down there. Everything for this box I'll link down in the description as in the where to get it, the Instagram page that is running this, and so on and so forth. Now, let's get straight into this box. I have to kind of open it off screen because I kind of don't want to drop anything. I don't have a table to put anything on, so I'm going to bring the things into camera frame. Okay, the first thing I want to talk about here is this card right here that I got from the person that sent us the box. I put it in my, my frame already. It says, thank you and stay spooky with the autograph. And on the back side, it is the image, which I'll put right here, of the logo. Next, let's talk about us actually being in the box. Here, I'll put that there. It's our QR code to take you straight to the channel and a button. So you guys can get your first ever Boo Bros button, which technically is like our first piece of merch. So if you guys want to get some Boo Bros merch, go ahead and buy yourself a box. Up next in the box, we have two, count them, two past Halloween Horror Night tickets. Both of these tickets are from HHN 29 and they're pretty cool to have. I have some of these of my own back in my box. I have a box of Horror Nights memorabilia that I keep if you guys didn't know. Would you guys like to do like us here at Boo Bros to do a video focusing on the different types of Horror Nights merchandise that we have? Or like haunt merchandise? Comment down below if you guys want us to do that. Speaking of haunt related merchandise, segue! We have two lanyards. This one's from HHN28, if you remember, this one came with the Amulet of Fear, which I have my Amulet of Fear put away right now with the rest of the Horror Nights memorabilia that I spoke of. And we have a lanyard from HHN26. You guys know my opinions on HHN26. If you don't, just go watch any of my videos where I talk about HHN26. Anyways, here's the lanyard for it. So it's pretty cool, you get two lanyards in here. And I gotta say, so far, this is a pretty cool box. I mean, compared to like your typical mystery box, it's not expensive either. It's $15, which I think is pretty affordable. So there's that. Up next in the box, we have three little bracelets. Now I'm not sure if every box comes with three, but this one for sure does. These are, let me try to get on the camera here. Cover up my hand, please pick it up. They say Jack's Maniacs. And on the back side, Hell yeah, Jack. Boom. So, three of these, three different colors. They're pretty cool. You know what? I'm gonna put one on for the rest of the video. Boom, got one on. Hell yeah, Jack. Now we're gonna keep going. I have some stuff here in my hand. You can get your own ET Interplanetary Passport. These are very very hard to come across right now especially with the fact that they aren't giving these out during COVID times so if you want your own little piece of ET get yourself one of these boxes so we also have these stickers with the logo that we spoke of earlier of the HHN Orlando fan page pretty cool we have three there so I might actually put one on here maybe somewhere in the background maybe maybe it's a huge maybe you also get I put it on here already. It's a button. Ah, sorry. I added it in on my little, I call this my media medallion, because I got this that one time, the media event that I had back in Hollywood. So, back where my family's from. I have my eight parks one day button. Theme park bar, if you guys haven't checked out theme park bar, go check out theme park bar, please. And then, the icing on the cake. This is in the in the box there, HHN Orlando fan page button. 
You can also add the Boo Bros button. I haven't put it on here yet. I will put it on here, but I like putting things on here that make me remember people. And now for the home stretch of what is in this box. We have, finally, I don't know how well you can see it, a jack pin. I apologize for the constant zoom in and zoom out. I've never done this before. Ah. A Palace Arcade token. A commemorative coin. A commemorative Halloween Horror Nights coin. That is double sided. Yeah. And then. To close it all off here, of course, we have ah, some Halloween Horror Night icon related stickers. You can put these on a tumbler, on the wall, on your notebook, on anything really. And then finally, two more items here, just two. We have a keychain with Jack's face blastered all over it. Pretty sick, you know, for all the Jack's maniacs out there. And then, finally, we have a pop socket with the caretaker on it. Now, as a Horror Nights fan, will I purchase this box? Like, would I purchase this box? Yes. I feel like it's pretty good for the price. If you think about it, the lanyards themselves cost you around $7 each anyway. So if you're buying two lanyards, it's already $15. So I mean, why not spend the $15 on a box that you can also get all this pretty cool and unique merchandise that you can't really buy anywhere else. I think it's a cool box. You guys should check it out because why not go to Horror Nights Orlando fan underscore page on Instagram, tell them Lost TV sent you. Tell them the Boo Bros bought you by. With all that being said, don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it. Comment down below if you want to get one of these boxes yourself. With all that being said, stay spooky, everybody. Peace.